So um, this project is about designing or using a device that will selecti selectively remove invasive carp from the streams during the spawning migration. So today this is I think the fifth day of this experiment. So the carp have been running for a few days and we know that they are running because we have a lot of electronic antennas in the stream that detect the, the presence of the carp. And um, we are building a uh, channel or a fence that directs or leads the fish into a floating fish ladder. And we want to make the carp swim up the ladder. So into the whoosh system to remove them. So we know that every day there's hundreds of fish that are trying to cross this particular stream section or electric guidance system in the water. So those fish are directed towards our passageway, which we call the gate. So we know that they're approaching the gate, but they're not swimming up the ladder yet. So we're trying to solve that particular problem. Um, in the Long Lake and the Lino Chain of Lake systems, while we're testing out these, these new tools, we really needed something that was more reliable and then economical on an annual basis. If this works, then these technologies could be used in other places in Minnesota to manage carp. Um, right now there's, there's not a lot of other tools for uh, managing carp, especially for getting the adult carp out of the system. If these work, then it could be a really economical way for, for other folks attempting to improve water quality by managing carp to, to do that.